Now we're going up towards Druids at about 120 miles an hour. Druids, the right hand, and through goes Watts, through goes Revalia, through goes O'Dor. Felden is in real trouble here. Oh, oh my goodness, he's lost it. Straight into the Armco. That looks a very nasty one indeed. John Clellan stationary. Well, we're in the car with him. And he seems to be all right. There's movement. He's clambering out of the Vauxhall. Well, he's, there he is. He's out of it. He's OK. My goodness, he was jolly lucky to get away with that. Leads into the car. Now, here's a replay from John Clellan's car. Menu is ahead. Watts goes through. Revalia goes through. Odor goes through. He turns in. Oh, there's contact. Somebody's hit him. He's lost it. Up goes the dust. Fade into the arm car. That's about 90 miles an hour he did that. And now this is a replay from Julian Bailey's car. O'Dor's Nissan ahead. There's Cleland on the left. He drops back a couple of places. Bailey closes up. They turn in. Bailey hits the box all. That's what happened. Off goes John Cleland. Through goes Jan Lammers in the Volvo. And now here's a replay from Rydell's Volvo. It's his teammate Dan Lammers ahead, behind Bailey and John Cleland. Now there you see, Bailey hits the Vauxhall and Rydell hits Bailey, who goes on. James Thompson going through on the right as they turn into Lodge Corner, the right-hander. Now look for the Peugeot on the right, there it is. Oh, and there's contact again. Rydell hits the Peugeot. Tiffany Dell goes through. And back at Druids, John Cleland is picking up the debris. The marshals move the car off the course. John Cleland legs it across. And at Fulston's, Whittlehock leads. Simone is second. Radisic is third. And number 10 is Alan Menu in the Renault, fourth position.